Well, as we mentioned, the snow was an issue during the morning commute today. Slick roads led to some accidents and lots of traffic out there. Despite the snow, though, students went to school on time today, which had some people complaining on social media. Maryland Bureau Chief Brad Bell live in Waldorf with today's snow report. Hi, Brad. Hey, Allison. Well, we're in Waldorf because this is where Doug Hill said the snow would be deepest, and in fact it was. But at this hour, really, this is all we could find left to show you. Most of the area looks like this now. The snow has melted off. That's Crane Highway. It is clean and dry. Not a lot of snow, but we did hear from a lot of unhappy people. With heavy snow falling, the highways wet and gridlocked. Perhaps Pamela Rhodes best describes our collective reaction to today's snow. Ugh. Ugh is right. The timing of today's dusting made for crazy long commutes. Basically, the roads are really uh, disgusting. People are trying to get to work and school at the same time. It's bumper to bumper all the way, miserable. School systems had decisions to make. All but Garrett County decided not to delay or close. In Montgomery County, that touched off a slew of Twitter complaints with photos of mishaps like this car on its side on Georgia Avenue and this slow speed pile up near Churchill High School. A school spokesman says a delay would have done no good and it wasn't bad enough to close. Well, this was the rare snowfall where the forecast was for more snow in places like this, Waldorf, south and east of the city. You can see none of it really stuck to any of the pavement, but Doug Hill said there would be one to three inches, and look at that. He hit the nail on the head. How does he do that? I am tired of snow. I just came back from Florida, and this is ridiculous. There is nothing we can do. Just wait for the summer. Early in the winter, we'd go out to do stories like this, and we'd ask people their thoughts on the weather. And with the snow falling, they'd say, it's so pretty, or they like winter. Nobody's telling us that now. I'm done with it. It's cold. And it's not fun to work in. It's not fun to drive in and deal with. I want summer back. <laughs> <laughs> he wants summer back. That was only about half of that guy's rant. And he repeated a phrase we heard over and over and over again today. A lot of people are looking forward to summer. Allison, could you lean over and pass that message along to Mr. Hill? In Waldorf, Brad Bell, ABC 7 News. We already have. We're, we're way in front of there, Brad. It's a hard sell, man. Yeah. I know. Thank you so much. All right. Well, to track how low the temperatures will go this week, just follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or WJLA.com. You can also download our ABC 7 weather app as well.